Hi, hello. It is a Thursday and where to begin? Actually, mm, the past week or so, I've been forgetting to vlog, so let's talk about it. Let's talk about what we've been doing. I went to Black Tap in Nashville, which is a new restaurant, bar, whatever. So I'm going to include the clips of the food here. Their wings were so good. I think that's like literally the only thing I really remember because I think we had too many shots. Because <laughs> let me show y'all here. There's a few shots. It was a stressful week. I think the week before work, my 9 to 5, not my nail job, my 9 to 5, that week was possibly one of the worst weeks I've ever had here at this job. It, it was a lot. Honestly, I think it was slick traumatic. I'm gonna need therapy after this because what? Anyways, it's almost been one year since I've been at this job, so I think it's about time for me to find a new position. But yeah, so pretty much I've been working, uh, working my 9 to 5, working my nail job, you know, working to survive, and we are barely touching the surface of water, okay? Yeah, it's a little struggle, but all I've been doing is working, working my two jobs, working out every single day, trying to eat healthy, trying to enjoy the little moments in life. That's why I title my vlogs now, Work to Live, because I literally work six days a week, and then the only free time that I have on my days off, I'm going to live it. I'm going to live it with my friends, my boyfriend, my family. I'm going to live life. So that's why I title these vlog series, Work to Live. But yeah, um, we went to Black Tap and then I think that's literally it. I think we went to like a bar that night and it was just not it. It was not it. Na Nashville is not what it used to be. It's very touristy now and like, not as fun as it what it used to be so a lot of the time if we go out we go out to like restaurants or lounges um not so much broadway not so much bars i guess you could say been doing a lot of like browsing a lot of like walking around at target got the caramel ribbon crunch with extra caramel this is so cute and of course we're at target They're like ombre. These are two. Yeah, I've actually been to Target a lot lately, as you guys can tell. But this weekend, I have a collab that I'm going to be showing you guys. I'm so, 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 so excited about. But yeah, it's in Nashville. So yeah, stay tuned for that. So we are staying here at a motel that I am partnering with. This is one of their cool murals. So this is our room. Um, it's literally just a room. It's like a remodeled motel. There's like a couch here and just a bathroom. Like that's literally it. Going to be in Fa and Delhi for some fun. Are you excited? Oh, babe. babe, you always have, <laughs> you always say that. <laughs>
like when I make my soups at home, I make them to where like I can't even eat it hot. Why? Because I want it super, super hot. This sriracha looks a little sus. Yeah, thank you. A little fish sauce because I like it a little salty. Black pepper. I'm putting a few in there. <laughs> we will find out. The cereal bar. I don't think I vlogged last time we came here. Look how cute it is. It's like little spoons. I think I'm gonna get ice cream. The small. With cookie dough and Oreos and caramel. I got vanilla with cookies and Oreo. I'm literally almost done. I have like two bites left. It's kind of chilly today. Bib. Ended up getting vanilla with Oreo and then she added cookies on top because they didn't have any more cookies. Oh, okay, go home. Going to Pinewood. This is our view. I'm so excited. There's three. Let me see if I can zoom in. Oh, they're so cute. There's one right there. There's mo they're mostly in the trees though. Put your arm next to it. It's like two of your forearm. Got a snack, got a hot dog, some fries, and I forgot they come with fries, so I accidentally ordered another thing of fries. Yeah, intuition. Just wanna follow intuition. All my senses tell me I know what you've been thinking. I know. I've been feeling. What if we got up left this party? Cause I can see you probably gonna be scrolling feeds all night long. And your friends are drunk. And the DJ keeps playing the same songs. And time isn't moving along. Hi! Oh my gosh, it's so cute. Someone that can really 
doing better, life cannot be more gold day, but honestly, I won't lie. I think this is new. That one literally has long hair. Oh my god! Look! That guy really just don't want a haircut. <laughs> what, if, what if you like it like that? Everybody else get a haircut. We finally found the bear. We put on the bear. Yeah, it's a red panda. Look. He's just chilling. Look how cute. We're in a gift shop right now. It's a little burger. Today has just been a very challenging day. It's honestly been a little tough. So I'm pretty excited to go and work out and get a good workout in and feel great. Today is Monday. I actually was off from my nine to five. They had like this thing where it's like customer care week or whatever, you get like one full day off or whatever. And so like my day was today. Yeah, I thought today was gonna be a great day. I thought today I was gonna get stuff done. But you know, the universe has other plans and you know, honestly, life is life. But here I am at the gym, I'm ready and I'm excited to get a workout in because I don't think I even went to the gym on Friday. Let's get this workout in. I'm gonna finish up my pre-workout and head in there. Can I just say, growing up, I was never in any type of sports or any type of physical activity. So being active wasn't really something I was used to. I would say up until like 2016 or so is when I really started this whole fitness journey. And I could say the past year or two is when I actually started to see real results. And that is because for so many years, I tried so many different workouts, I've tried high intensity workouts i've tried hot yoga i've tried like bar i feel like i've tried so many different things and it took me so long to really learn what my body needs and trying to figure out what really works because what worked for other people did not work for me so it took me a minute to figure out what my body needed also it really took me a long time to figure out what my body goals were or what physical goals I really wanted to achieve because throughout the years they changed a lot a lot of things I wanted but then figured out I really didn't want and then figuring out oh I want something else so yeah it really took me a minute to figure out what my goals are and what I truly want and it came down to just being healthy I want to be stronger I want to be healthy from the inside so it took me a while to really figure out what kind of foods to eat, and what kind of workouts worked best for me and my body. But I'm here to say, whatever you do, do not give up because small progress is better than none at all. Especially coming from someone that did not work out growing up at all. You got this. 